But, uh, no, good morning, everybody. Thank you very much for, uh, for, for coming along today. And, and kind of um, really, what I want to do is just introduce Jane Recruitment, what we do, uh, and, and how we may be different to other agencies, because there are plenty of agencies out there. Um, Jane's mission to provide a quality and reliable recruitment service across Kent, tailored to our clients' individual business needs. What we mean by that is we understand that every client is different, no client has the same need. Whether that be minimum wage work, where the workers are very basic, low skilled workers, we understand that they are different in their own right. Um, not necessarily just to the higher end people, but, but in themselves. I've got a client that will be uh, smashing up TVs all day and I've got a client that might be packing fruit. There's very different skills that people need. One person might be very dexterous, might be very nimble with their hands and very skilled with their hands. Another might be quite big, quite physical. It's about getting them right and sending the right person to the right client. Whether that be at the higher end scale, if somebody's got the right qualifications. If we're looking for an accountant, for example, we're really looking for somebody with an ACA qualification or ACCA and not somebody who's maybe got legal secretary skills. Uh, Jane, we deal with four main industries. Um, we've got the catering and hospitality. Uh, with that, um, that's the kind of the bar staff and things like that. We've got uh, a lady in our office called Christina. She deals with that. The industrial work, that uh, falls under my remit. I've got uh, Matt working alongside me as well. So we both deal with any of the warehouse factory work. We have transport, so that would be your drivers. Your class 1s, your class 2s, your 7.5 tonne drivers, your forklift drivers, anything like that. Got a colleague called Helen who deals with that. And then we've got the uh, business and office administration. Uh, it's a good chance to introduce Cara, many of you already know, but Cara deals with the off, uh, business office administration. So, what different types of recruitment are there? Um, one of the ones which is quite popular is temporary recruitment. This is particularly popular with the industrial desk and catering and hospitality desk. Um, so, what is temporary recruitment? Um, basically, JM Recruitment will find you, will source you and screen temporary staff for you. Um, so they work for you on an ad hoc basis. So if you don't need them anymore, that's fine. You just let us know. You let us know when you need them and we will supply them. Um, this can be particularly good for the catering clients who have weddings. Um, they, they just need them for the odd weekends for those events, peak seasons, Christmas when it's particularly busy. Similarly, some of Jason's clients that he has, um, they have peaks and troughs with it. Let them at the um, peak seasons about 130 a day. Something yeah, in one department, yeah. yeah. It's probably about 180 across all departments. But then at low season, what do they drop to? About 10, 15 people. So we, by using us, it helps them manage their staff. We manage it for them, and it makes it much more cost effective for them. So the staff are employees of JM Recruitment, so we find all do original sourcing and replacement sourcing um, if at the moment that's required. And we cover their hourly pay rate, their holiday pay, their sickness, and their employers' national insurance contributions. On the other side of things, uh, there's permanent recruitment. Permanent recruitment is probably more the traditional side of recruitment, which many of you know of. Um, it basically, we will then find, we source, we advertise and screen candidates for whatever position you are looking for. Um, so Jane Britton will advertise, source and screen them. This saves the, uh, the client the time and the cost of doing all that screening themselves. We have numerous job boards, we have our websites, um, we use a lot of social media, um, and obviously our networks and our bank of candidates as well. And we have specialists in each sector um, to help find the right candidate for you. And this um, works out as a, a pay of a percentage of the annual salary. One which um, you may not be aware of is the Temp to Perm scheme. This is something which we do and which is very popular with many of our clients uh, because it's really great at combining the temporary and the permanent source of recruitment um, just to add that extra flexibility and reduce the risk of recruiting new staff. So how this works is that we will provide a suitable candidate uh, for you for a position which you think you probably will take on permanently but you're just not sure at this time. Um, so we, for the first 12 weeks, you have a trial period. So in effect, it's like a trial before you buy. Um, so you have 12 weeks to trial that candidate. 
If at any point during this 12 week period, you might feel that actually there's not a need for that position anymore, things haven't gone the way you thought they would, that candidate just might not actually be as suitable as you thought they were, um, well, whatever the reason is, um, you just could give us a call and we can remove that candidate, we can find your replacement if you need them, and at no additional charge. Um, so it just gives you the added flexibility because during that 12 week trial period that candidate is an employee of JM Recruitment, so you have no ties. At the end of the 12 week trial period you can then take that candidate on permanently um, if you wish and the, uh, the finance fee for that is significantly reduced because you've already had them work through you for 12 weeks. So this is a really popular one for clients wishing to grow and looking um, just to take that risk out of recruitment for them. Um, thank you, Guy. Um, why pick JM Recruitment? Um, some simple things, as I've already mentioned, you, we listen to your individual uh, business needs. We really find that that's something that a lot of clients come back to us as a really positive thing. We're not just there to get in, try to fill the position, chuck CVs at people that just don't match, just because we're trying to, trying to lock those candidates away from other agencies by sending the CVs or, or anything stupid like that. We really listen to your needs before we start uh, putting anybody forward. Um, we personalise it to you, we reduce, reduce the risk for them. Um, obviously we get people that do have SSP, that can be quite a burden for employers, certainly small businesses, well, we can take that burden away by employing somebody you know you've got fixed costs for a service you're going to get. If you're a person, say they become pregnant for example, you don't need to then worry about that cost, we'll deal with that cost, that's not charged on to you. Um, you'll get a personal account manager, I've already mentioned the four different industries, one of that person will be your account manager, you'll have their mobile number, it's a 24 7 service. Um, you will always be able to get hold of them and if you can't, there is another number that you can call which you will, but I almost guarantee you, unless a person's in the shower or something like that, you will get hold of them and if you don't, they will call you back. <coughs> um, we have access to HR and legal team, um, Cara is our HR genius um, and, and our legal genius, so anything like that that we're not sure of, Take, pass on to Cara and she'll speak to a legal team that, that is sorted for us. Um, we are licensed with the GLA, it's the Game Master and Licensed Authority, uh, and, and also members of the REC, FSB and ALB. I think we need to speed up, sorry there's not a clock so I couldn't, couldn't judge it. Um, we've got some, some testimonials there, um, I won't read them through but there are a few there if you wish to have a look, you can speak to us after and we'll, we'll show you. Okay, so who to refer to us? When it comes to the size of the business, it really doesn't mean anything because we tailor it to the individual business, as we said. Small businesses or medium-sized companies may just need the ad hoc assistance uh, for busy seasons. They may not require the cost of taking on staff permanently, but they may just need it for when, when, when they're busy. Um, they may need it for holiday, sickness cover, um, or just to increase their health with those busy periods. Um, with the larger companies, as we mentioned, it's the fluctuating numbers, fluctuating requirements. Uh, and we can also assist with um, just the general HR management for that. And uh, the rotors, the training, uniforms and PPE wear, managing the payroll and employment legislation for them. So just an assisting managing seasonal staffing requirements for the larger companies. I think what we'll do is we'll, we'll leave it there being, I'm assuming Andy will give me two, that's two minutes up. Well, no, you won't, you, you won't tell me. <laughs> <laughs> Question, same for I'll leave it there then. I did put a state agency on the top here and it's a stack day, but I think that's uh, pretty pointless. But, uh, <laughs> um, so is there any questions from anybody? Yep? On the, um, the attempt of her, how do you treat auto enrolment? The pensions that are coming um, uh, We go, go on, go on. You, you, it's already managed with it. We've got a uh, company that will sort that for us. It's, it's part of us. So all of our staff are automatically enrolled. Um, upon registration, they are also given the number to contact if they have any questions about that. Um, so that's all done for you. Anyone who uses our services does not have to worry about that. Once the person's gone permanent, though, of course, that will be your responsibility. Yep. Any other questions? Fantastic. Thank <laughs> you.